Hello, everyone. Welcome back to your favorite troubleshooting channel, Fix Netflix YouTube channel. If you stay with us all the way to the end of this video and try each of these methods, and there is very high probability that this problem will be solved for you. Several factors can cause a Fire TV stick to not connect to the internet. Here are some common reasons. Number 1. Wi-Fi signal issues. Number 2. Incorrect Wi-Fi password. Number 3. Network configuration. Number 4. Router issues. Number 5. Software updates. In this video, we will show you through some easy steps for non-technical people to fix the issue and get your DV back online. Before we start if you find this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel. Fix Netflix for more helpful tech tips and tutorials. If you face any problems during the session, then don't hesitate to inform me on comment section. I will be happy to help you and answer your all queries as soon as possible. So, let's start it. Step 1. Check Internet Connection If your DV is not connecting to Wi-Fi, the first step is to troubleshoot the network connection. Start by checking if other devices in your home can connect to the Wi-Fi network. If other devices are working fine, then the issue may lie with the TV itself. Step 2. Restart router, modem and TV. Our second step is to restart your router and TV. This is a good first thing to try if you are having network issues, as it can often fix problems not just for your TV but for all your connected devices. Here is how to do it. Unplug the power cable from your router and TV. Then wait for 2 minutes. While waiting, Press and hold the power button on your DV for 10 seconds to get rid of any remaining electricity. Then plug the power cable back into your DV and wait for it to turn on again. Following these steps can help resolve connectivity issues. Step 3. Replace router closer to the TV. Sometimes, your router may be too far from your TV. Try moving it closer to establish a better connection. Ensure that your DV is within range of the Wi-Fi router and there are no physical obstructions that could weaken the signal. Step 4. Update TV Firmware Your DV might not be running on the latest firmware version. Now, this comes with frequent bugs. So your TV running on an older firmware version could also be a reason behind Wi-Fi connection issues. Step 5. Use a 5 GHz Wi-Fi band. Using the 5 GHz Wi-Fi band can help improve the performance of your Wi-Fi connection, as it can be less crowded and less prone to interference than the 2.4 GHz band. However, it is essential to note that the 5 GHz band has a shorter range than the 2.4 GHz band, so it may be less effective if you try connecting devices far away from the Wi-Fi router. Step 6. Connect an Ethernet cable to TV. If you cannot connect your TV to your Wi-Fi network, try connecting it to your network using an Ethernet cable instead. This can be a good option if you are experiencing issues with the Wi-Fi signal or want to ensure a stable and reliable connection. Step 7. Check the time and date settings. Sometimes, your TV's internet connection may not work properly due to incorrect time and date settings. The time and date settings are crucial for various functions of the TV, including accessing online content and services. To resolve this issue, you should ensure that your TV's time and date settings are configured correctly. Step 8. Connect to a mobile hotspot. If you are unable to connect your TV to the internet, you may be able to connect to a hotspot using your mobile device. A hotspot might be helpful if you have a temporary network outage or your streaming device is outside of Wi-Fi range and need to set up a DV powered by DV operating systems. Step 9. Uninstall your VPN app from TV. 
If you have a VPN installed on your TV, it may be preventing the TV from connecting to the internet. You can quickly rule this out by temporarily uninstalling the VPN and checking to see if you can connect to the internet. If that fixes the problem, contact the developers of your VPN app for information about how to configure it. Step 10. Reset your TV. When all else fails, it's time for a factory reset. Just be aware that this will erase all your settings, accounts, and apps, returning your TV to its original state. So, that's the whole story, my friends. We have covered the steps to fix Wi-Fi or internet connection issues on your Fire TV stick. If you face any problems or still have same experience, please leave a comments here. I will be happy to help you. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. And subscribe to our channel Fix Netflix for more tech tips and tutorials. If you have any questions or need further assistance, Feel free to leave a comment below. Thanks for watching this video and we will see you in the next video.